Hey everyone, welcome to a brief tutorial on the new Blender 4.1 Bake Note. If you want to see a more detailed guide with practical examples, be sure to watch my other video on auto damage systems. Without further ado, let's dive into new Blend file. The new Bake Note is really cool addition to the Geometry Node system. Essentially, it enables us to break down complex and time-consuming node trees into smaller parts, enabling quicker and more efficient workflow. For example, we have this nice edge damage effect on basic geometry. However, maybe you want to scatter some plants on top of it. In practice, this becomes really challenging because every modification in the node tree results in several seconds of waiting for calculations. Certainly not an ideal situation. But since Blender 4.1, the new bake node comes to save us. By integrating the bake node into our workflow and hitting the bake button, we are suddenly able to swiftly resume our work on the geometry node system. But what exactly is this magic all about? When we hit the bake button, Blender applies all the nodes and saves the final results into a file on our disk. This process eliminates the need for Blender to recalculate everything each time a change is made. However, it's essential to note that any change made before the bake node won't affect the final result unless the bake button is pressed again. Therefore, we must remember to hit the bake button whenever we want to update something before the bake node. This node also offers two modes animation for baking animation within a specified range, and still for baking single frames. To delete the baked data, we can simply click on the trash icon here. So that's essentially the entire bake node. It's an incredibly useful addition for the geometry node system, particularly for more complex and time-consuming systems. So that's it. I hope you learned something new with this tutorial. If you want to support the channel, you can check my add-ons, link in the description. See you again soon, and bye!